I, I don't, I don't, I don't think I should, something tells me I really shouldn't go up there, but like the curiosity is in full control right now. I really want to know if there's a checkpoint one up there. Oh, what was that? That, oh no, this is the authentic version for gutsy players. This is a collab between Shade Kitty and River. And um, I've River used to go by another name and I'm blanking on uh, Mr. CP0. Thank you, Zelda. So this is a collab between Shade Kitty and Mr. CP0. With a name like this, surely it's gonna be a fun time for everyone. <laughs> I love this meme so much. <laughs> It's just, but there's just gonna be like a, I bet there's a spike below it. I bet you there's just a spike. <laughs> Wait, I love that. Spikened. <laughs> I love it so far. Wait, uh, this is a really good level so far. Oh my God. <laughs> Uh, 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 ah! Mm, shit. I'm quite liking this level so far. Okay, there is shenanigans going up. Shenanigans are afoot right here. Mm, shenanigans! Why did I die? Nobody likes to die to something off screen. Come on. Boing. <laughs> oh my goodness. You know, nothing like a light speed Koopa shell to the forehead to really get you going. To really start your day strong. Ooh, ah, it comes back. What? Where did that? There's no way that you knew the fish could, should go right there. What was that fish placement? That was outrageous. I am really loving this level so far. What a fantastic job. Holy shit. What is that fish? Where am I going? Oh, I'm probably just down. Wait, I'm supposed to go this way. No. <laughs> should be safe right here. Okay. No greed. Where did I? Oof. I made it. Okay, this is new. Oh, I just. I jumped and it's freaking low gravity so that I did a t I did a tiny jump. I did not hold down the jump button. I did a tiny jump and it was low grav. Get down the pipe and then we just wait. We hold our ground. <laughs> What's this spike? Oh, what was that shit? <laughs> I still don't understand why that fishbone just dies. So holding right, I guess we'll survive. Oh my gosh, that's so glitched. Um, what's in here? Nothing in here. It looks like I want to kick the bomb over there and then I'll be able to get the mushroom. I feel like it's gonna go wrong, but I don't see how. Why is this not gonna work? It's not a breakable block. It's one of these fucking blocks. The ones with the circle thing on them don't break. How do I get that mushroom? Maybe I just jump over there immediately. All right, go through the gap. I think I still do that, but I should just get ready to snag the mushroom. Yeah, there we go. Oh! My goodness, that almost got me. Um, I don't think I want to hit that because it won't do anything right now. Why would I want to hit that? It would just make it so I couldn't progress. I think I YOLO jump off of here. There's nothing above or below me though, so... Where am I going exactly? <laughs> oh no! <laughs> So I think this was fine and I just have to drop out of the claw. I'm curious what happens when I hit this. It doesn't do anything. I wonder if it's gonna bite me in the butt later. There we go, I just have to get out of that. Whoa, I don't like this. No. <laughs> you coming back? Hello? Thank you. 
I think I'm gonna just... Oh. I see. I see the issue. Technically, I can still make this. That doesn't help, though. Okay. Probably need to get that mushroom. Now we get out of there. For this part... Oh my goodness. Okay. Um, I kind of want to just hit the on and off switch and not hit that. I'm just going to hit the on and off switch. I don't want... What? What? It's down here. I could have made it up there if I like did that, but I, I was not able to do that fast enough and that's not easy to do. Now you, now you fucking kidding. I love this. Wow. Amazing. Moloch. Oh. <laughs> oh? Wait, I did something different right there. Maybe. Is there a way to get out of this? I'm so close to getting out. Oh, I think I might be able to do it. I have to hold jump until the top of that and then barely come back down. No. I thought I was gaining some speed, gaining some speed on it, but I'm not. Damn, I thought maybe there was a crazy cheese, but there was not. I have stories from teaching chemistry. Uh, so the worst cheater that I ever encountered while teaching a university level class. Okay, this is, this is a true story, mind you. We had, oh dang it. Um, we had an assignment and this was in a chemistry class. And part of the way through the assignment, um, they had to answer things, uh, they had to sort of read through a paragraph and then they had to write some stuff down to answer something and then it eventually ended in a chemistry question or whatever. Um, somewhere in there, it had you write down your own name for using in the example. Okay, so the question itself, like partway through it, you had to write down your own name. This person, who obviously copied somebody, wrote down the other person's name that they had copied from because it was they thought it was part of the answer. So they literally wrote the other person's name on the assignment. And lo and behold, they were both the same. Worst copier of all time. <laughs> okay, so hitting this doesn't do anything right now. Can I jump up here? I can literally just jump up here. I am so dumb, by the way. Oof. Almost missed that. All right, now we should be able to escape the moles. Yes, if you want, let's go. Let's go. Nah, CP1 was awesome. No soul breaking here. CP1 was great. CP1 was great. You worked as a TA before, had someone who just copied someone else's homework and submitted that. And by scanned, I mean literally scanned the thing. They just scanned it in. Turned it in. Okay, um, I guess I'm gonna hit this and see what happens. Chinese? Where do they get? Chinese go away. Where am I supposed to go here? Oh, that's a switch. <laughs> Wait, that's not good. I need it. That's a cute setup. I really like that setup. It's not usually the tests that are a problem for the classes that I've been a part of. It's like the homework. That might be fine, actually. No, what was that? <laughs> I turned back. <laughs> That was very well-timed switch state change right there. Okay, the sound is driving me absolutely mad. You can't beat it. <laughs> Don't go down there. That is a crazy setup. It doesn't trigger until you're like in the block. I waited so long that time. Okay. Oh. Do I want that clown car? Maybe actually. Maybe this is what I want. Uh oh. I don't think this is what I want. No. <laughs> uh, I had somebody who tried to use Chad GPT to like improve their writing in a science paper, and it was terrible. What? What's that? 
Oh. All right. All right. You just get out of here. Whoa, look at that setup. You can see a little bit of it with that seesaw. All right, well, I, anytime you see a launcher and a clown car in Wario Maker, expect jank. Here we go. That was, <laughs> was not the jank I expected. Go back here. I shouldn't, I shouldn't, I'm doing it, but I really shouldn't. I shouldn't. It just, is that okay? I saw that thing came out of there. Maybe that's okay. What happens if I hit this? There were two blocks in that block. Okay, let's just go here. Okay, I couldn't change that. That thing still spits out, so let's just dodge the fish. I was like, is this a soft block? There we go. Okay, I just fake jump up there? Yeah, okay. Oh, I can still get this too. Um, I'm scared. All right, this is fine. Why is there a pokey head right there? Why is there a pokey head right there? <laughs> oh, one way or another. Um... Are you fucking kidding me? That just soft locked me. That literally just softlocked me. What's this game, dude? <laughs> That's what it takes to softlock you. One conveyor belt. This level is really good. Uh, no, I... Did I... I don't even know if I needed the POW. I guess we'll find out. <gasps> oh, this doesn't go off unless I get the POW. I wonder how that works. If I don't hit that block... That never activates right there. How weird. Okay, um... Is there really a point in doing this at all, though? Maybe the Pokey boops it in. No, po Pokey didn't boop it in. That's very weird. How am I supposed to actually do this then? Maybe I drop it in there and then I run out or something. That's weird. Again, I've had it be fixed for several months, but it just always eventually goes back again. Um, I guess I'm gonna try... This doesn't do anything. I'm gonna try doing that again and then just getting out of there. Maybe now the pokey head will nudge it forward or something? How are you supposed to do this? Maybe I just- Oh, I just throw the pow. I'm so stupid. I can just throw the pow to break the muncher. Like, I could just lay in my bed in the complete darkness for two hours. And I could do that every night. You know, while- when, Like, let's say I'm falling asleep at 10 p.m. It, I could just have complete darkness for two hours. Okay, there we go. We just do that. And I'll do that for an entire week. And a week later, my body still wants to go to bed at 6 a.m. <laughs> All right. Um, let's see. This looks like an obvious duck down the pipe right here. This is... All right, this level's old and... This level's like a few months old. Oh, what, what's the meta? It's too obvious. It's too obvious. So I think the solution is to, I think the real solution is to just go down the pipe. Yeah, there's not even a, <laughs> there's not even a pipe. Oh, that's genius. That's, it's getting less, okay, yeah, 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 that's genius, that's genius. I really like that setup. There's just no pipe there. Oh, shit. All right, we correctly called the meta. Where was the switch? Wait, no, wait, 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 this is bad. Where was the switch? <gasps> There's this, I like how it shows you the switch. <laughs> That's a good hint. I like how it literally just takes you to the switch and it's like, here it is, dummy. Okay, uh, so somehow I can hit this again. Oh, I guess I can just literally go and hit it again right here, can I? 
That's so smart. Oh, jeez. This has twice twice potential, though. No twice twice yet. And there's the twice twice. Oh, yeah, there it is. There it is. Give me that twice twice. Yeah. That. <laughs> Give me my cloud car. Come on. Uh, this is a Shade Kitty collab. What? Oh. All right. I think I need to jump on it to when it's still over to the right. Hmm. There we go, that's way easier. Okay, I'm gonna get this this time. Maybe this time it's gonna matter. Didn't look like it. Oh god, it, literally anything could happen now. That's still there. <laughs> this it just doesn't activate now. Shit! Mm. All right, we're not gonna fall for the next one. We're not gonna fall for the next one. What am I doing again? No better way to start the morning. Crash the stream every nine minutes. Yeah, I don't know. I can get him. No! <laughs> oh, that's really good. How are there two pals now? Get this. Now I need to dodge that. I think I throw this one and then I'll probably want to grab that one. Okay. Hmm. Hmm. I think this time I don't want to hit the pal. I'm, I, I'm calling it right now. I'm not falling for another twice twice. All right, this time I don't hit the power. I'm still gonna put it down here though, just in case it matters. I'm not hitting it. God damn it! <laughs> All right, let's grab the first pow, throw it, grab the second pow. I think I do want to end up throwing it. And then I just need to jump up and dodge. Oh my God, how do I dodge that? Oh, if I just, if I go, no, what? But moments are going away. I can't bring the pal with me. Let the pal fly there. <gasps> that is a smart idea. Oh my god, I could have been here all night. If that's the solution... I might have been here all night. Yeah. Oh, it... I did just have to wait. Okay, it wasn't... Well, that was a great idea, though. Whoever had that idea, that was big brain. I'm so afraid. Can you see something? There's something there. I can see it. I'm so afraid. Kaiser Block. I knew it. I fucking called it. Okay. Oh, shit. I think that might have just been a distract. Wait, it's this shit again. Could there be a pipe this time? Oh, man. What if there's a pipe this time? If, if there's a pipe this time, then kudos to them. How is How could there be a pipe this time and not the other time? <laughs> there is! How did they do it? <laughs> How did they do it? Oh, wow. How is there a pipe that time and not the other time? Wow, this level's fantastic. As Geek would say, a little delight. We're gonna try this strat, alright? Cosmic brain person in Twitch chat. <laughs> it was completely unnecessary, but I loved it. All right. I loved it. Oh Shit. Oh, that's where that comes from. Okay So um, in this case, I think I just go over here probably Shit. <gasps> Let's go. I shouldn't go up here. Okay. Is this a different area? Are we just not in the same room? Ah! <sighs> I walked right into it. Wait. Wait. Go! Oh, CP2, let's go. Oh my goodness. That was a really good twice twice. Best one I've seen in quite a while. Shocks. <laughs> you guys. <laughs> I, I don't, I don't, I don't think I should, something tells me I really shouldn't go up there, but like the curiosity is in full control right now. I really want to know if there's a checkpoint one up there. 
It's so tempting. We gotta at least explore over here first before we get desperate. Before we get desperate. Is that seesaw gonna just seesaw me? Amazingly, it doesn't. <laughs> Holding the pow is enough weight. Wow. Oh, what was that? Was that seriously planned? I can't believe that worked like that. That was really good. Yeah, that was like a Looney Tunes bit. What the fuck is this? I'm gonna just... I'm gonna just run. Okay. I guess I should hit this. And then it looks like, it looks like as soon as I hit this, that... As soon as I hit this, that piranha looks like it's gonna yeet right on me. I'm gonna just... So in my head, I was going to beat the piranha. And for the absolute wrong reason, I was there ready for the pow. Uh-oh. Uh-oh, what's in this door? Uh-oh. No, 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 you got the wrong person. You got the wrong person. You want, you want, you want freak and geek? I'm Carl, okay? You got the wrong guy. Guts! And we're back again. Yay! The level was really good. Playing it again would be a treat. We should thank the level maker for giving us this opportunity. There wouldn't have been any other good way to play the level again from that checkpoint. You know, if we restarted, we have to go from the beginning. Shit, I forgot. Oh my god, that <laughs> Alright. Let's grab it. Let's not get CP1 this time, please. And thank you. How do I avoid CP1? I think I hold right. I just hold right. I just hold right. <sighs> no CP1. Hmm. I think I'm gonna take a peek up here. Okay, no peek up here. Uh. Oh, I actually perfectly called that. I perfectly called that. Let's go. We're gaming. Big troll gaming right now. Do I want this? Okay, if I hit this, the mushroom on the left side is gonna start going. Oh no. <laughs> you know this isn't gonna work right. But here's my plan. I'm gonna hit this and then I'm gonna run into my safety hole right here. Shit! <laughs> That's not very safe. Nice, All right, let's hit this like twice and then let's, oh, go down here. It comes back. Oh. Well, that's nice. I mean, I'm tempted to hit it again. I guess I can't... <laughs> I really shouldn't. <laughs> no, 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 no. We're just gonna take what we got and get out of there. Do I... There's only one red coin in the level. <laughs> what? What's that all about? Is that even a troll? What's over here to the left? It could be a helmet. <laughs> it could be a helmet. <laughs> Oh shit. It could be a helmet! Ah! I like the the wraparound boot. I think I want the boot though. Okay. The sound it makes is crazy. Oh my gosh, it's gonna No no no, I don't like this. Okay. Does it normally make that sound? That sound is wild. If I had accidentally gone on these, it would have sucked me up into those spikes, I think. Oh shit, I think we're okay. No, I hit something. What did I hit? I think I'm good still. What is that? 50 down there. Mm, but how do I avoid the 50? I'm gonna YOLO jump and then go back down. <gasps> Damn it. <sighs> okay. 
How do I not get hit by that? Shoot! Maybe if I go immediately through it, that's what I need to do. I need to not stomp on the side. Let's just go fast. That's what I need to do. Oh, I don't think I want to be in here. No, 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 not more guts, not more guts, not more guts. That's the same fucking fight, not more guts. I've had enough guts, thank you very much. Uh, not more guts. The stream is neither early or late. It arrives precisely when it means to. Okay. <laughs> Not like this. Not like this. Not like that. That Kaizo, why was it even there? I just jumped for the shinies. That's all I did. Oh, yes, I'll get CP1 again. Don't go down this freaking pit. I cannot believe that Kaizo. Oh, what is this nonsense right here? It's looking like I have to... No, it's gonna put me down the pit again. I'm not in the pit yet. <laughs> Level creator must be so proud of themselves right now. Oh, it's when when you know where you're going and you're still powerless to stop it. That's some good troll. No more. No more. Oh, I think I hold right here. There we go. There we go. Oh, come on. Come on. What is that even? My favorite part is the like five minutes that it takes <laughs> just to see if we get CP1. No, I was worried about that happening for so long and it never happened. And now it finally happened. Please, no more in there. All right. I think we want to just dodge the fish. Like Is that- there's no way that prevents you from going in that fight. Does it really? Oh my gosh, you li that- that is enough to prevent you from going in a fight. What? Get me out. Get me out. GG. I don't believe you for a minute that it's GG. I knew it. I don't believe you for a minute. Why does it- it says I need... No, why did I... That was the dumbest death of all time. Why did it... No. Okay, let's try get looking for a spring over here. Oh, God, moles. Is this bad? Why does this feel bad to me? I feel like I shouldn't be here. There's the spring. Oh, what the fuck is that? <laughs> what is that? What should I do differently this time? Hmm. We're just gonna watch this thing grow. No, I needed to be there, really? Shit. Can I make that? Oh, I can still- <gasps> Hitboxes! No, I can't. All right. All right. There we go. There we go. Now we have the spring. Surely we will beat the level. <laughs> Oh, surely we will be the level. Forget what got me last time. Mm, do I go fast? No, 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 Which gonna go back? <laughs> Is there a way to maybe make a collab instead of having your own? 
Um, <laughs> no. <laughs> no. No. For now, though, we need to figure this last bit out. We can get the spring here. And we can kind of dodge this setup by doing that. But now what? It's gonna fall back down. Let's wait. Oh, this is actually good. Oh my gosh, this is actually good. I don't know if I want the pow. I said I want the spring. It said ring the spring. We're gonna trust. Shit, that was at the... Oh, that muncher was not there last time. Marmaduke Dupe Deluxe. I'm hoping. All right, I'm just gonna hold right. I think that's all we need to do. Oh shit, no. The hitbox gets me again, come on. I think we have this. I think we're, we're finally here to win. I don't want this pow. The pow is a mistake. It's all just a trick because if you're holding either the pow or the spring, you can't grab the vine. And if, as long as we just grab the vine, we're fine! Oh, there we go. Oh my gosh. That level was absolutely wonderful. And then we went into a death spiral for 200 years. Oh, huge shout outs to Shade, uh, Shade Kitty and River. AKA Mr. CP0 for making that level. It was really fun. Uh, how do we find a new strain of a virus? Well, um, these days there is the, we have these wonderful devices that you can basically take a little bit of a virus uh, or of anything. Like for instance, if you, find some new organism of any sort you could just like get some cells from it or even from like a person now and you can put it through this machine and it tells you the dna sequence that that thing contains now obviously you need to do a little bit of chemistry to get it to work right or whatever but for the most part um it's very fast and very simple and very cheap these days so like it used to cost millions of dollars for instance or even more than that, hundreds of millions of dollars billions of dollars to sequence uh, a really big genome like a human's. Uh, viruses are much smaller, so it's a little bit easier. But anyway, these days, um, it's not really that expensive at all for even for a big genome. Um, so for instance, if there's, if somebody is sick and um, people wanna find out like, hey, are they sick with a new type of virus? They can take a sample of that person's, like let's say their saliva, um, and they could, well, probably what they would do uh, there's so you could do like a discovery sort of an experiment where you're like I want to see all the things that are in here or if you like already know that COVID exists and you want to know specifically if there's a new strain of COVID in there you might like do something to the sample beforehand to like select out um you could just you could particularly get like viruses that have certain characteristics that you might be able to um for instance some viruses are predominantly RNA or all RNA or whatever and some are DNA um, and some have other features that you might like select for. But if you want the whole thing, you can just put the whole sample through one of these sequencing machines and um, get all of the DNA that's present in that sample and it'll kind of read it out to you and you can sort of search it. Um, and that's the key though, because like you get a bunch of DNA, you still need to figure out, is it a virus? Is it a particular type of virus? Like how do you figure out what it actually is? Um, so there are databases of all known gene sequences and um, due to the fact that all life um, it, all life came from common ancestors and shares all of these similarities in DNA, you can actually simply compare any sequence of anything that, you know, it, it wouldn't work on alien life, but any life that came from our planet, um, you can actually do some amazing kind of like um, detective work using the DNA sequence to figure out how close it is to something else. So for instance, uh, when COVID was first discovered, um, they would do th they did this and they looked at the sequence and compared it to all other known sequences. And it turned out the sequence was similar to coronaviruses. And so that's how they were like, oh, it's a coronavirus. Um, and so if you have a new, if like, let's say a ton of people are getting sick and you do this sort of sequencing experiment and you compare the sequences of the people who are getting sick, you could compare it to all the other known viruses and be like, oh, maybe this is a new influenza virus or whatever. 
And so doing this comparison lets you know, is it a new strain of COVID? Is it a new strain of the flu? Is it something else entirely? Hopefully that answers your question.